preview for Swansea v Brentford on the week uh, tomorrow. <laughs> um, so pretty much what happened last game was um, some people say we got robbed. I'm not like really sure how we got robbed, but we did lose. At the end of the day, we did deserve to win, and uh, I think we should have. So. Um, Going into tomorrow's game, we got Brentford. They drew what no no will win up, and um, I think they will um, be threats to us, especially because we they got um, especially because they got like Daniels. Uh, they haven't got Daniels in goals this time. Um, we obviously we beat them four one um, within the season because we knocked them up before. We was Man City. Um, just a quick reminder, go and check out my other preview for Nottingham Forest featuring Chucky Cheese TV. Um, yeah, good one. Um, so going into tomorrow's game, uh, obviously we had the devastating news that the Irwin Mulder wasn't going to be available for the rest of the season, which is, in my opinion is a massive blow considering he going all felt with in goals now. Um, he he he's not the best away from home, but when he's home, he can be decent because he got the Jack Army behind him, and uh, all that. So, I th personally think my score prediction is a two three nil Swansea actually, uh, because um, obviously we got the better of them last time. We know what to expect from them, and they obviously know what to expect from us. So, um, obviously I I think. We will beat them, uh, three nil. So, um, yeah, Brentford, they got some strong um players like Neil Morpe, um, uh, Said Ben Rama, um, and yeah, it's about that um, Bentley, good and goal, um, class keeper. Watch the highlights for uh the Wigan game on. Saturday, which they played, and uh, yeah, so um, yeah, so obviously, we have no Leroy. Uh, Joe Rodan is expected to come back for Middlesbrough, so we're gonna play Carter for Kiss tomorrow, and uh, yeah, so um, Leroy's still out, he, he might return for I'd say QPR away, um, and uh, yeah, so I think uh. We will um I think we I think we will uh get this one over the line and uh, grab a three points. Obviously we've got three at home. Um and then we got QPR away and going to so I'll be well now. Obviously, um and then I haven't actually seen the Brentford team news. Um yeah, so um from what I've heard, they're looking very strong at the moment. Um, last time we beat them 4-1 in the cup. Yes, and with goals from uh, Selina twice, Dan James and uh, Byers. So, yeah. Just looking at the Brentford team news now. And uh, they were out with Romain Sayers um, on Saturday against Wigan. But uh, yeah, they should be with it tomorrow. Uh, young Barbat, their defender is out due to an injury from Saturday against Wigan. So um, yeah, that should be a massive blow for them. Obviously, um, I've explained the Swans team news. So I'm gonna go with a three 0 Swans win. Um, from uh goals from McBurney. James will score again, Selena. So, um, yeah. So, I. Yeah, so Swans, obviously, on the back of a 2 1 loss to Forest, which is one of the summer like that. Um, we were fouling each other quite but much. I don't know who scored for us. It could have been Byers, it could have been Robbers, because uh, I've seen the goal. 
it took a touching from Roberts, but uh, I personally think that um, I th I, per I personally think that Bayer's got it. So uh, yeah, and uh, yeah, so that's gonna be the end of the preview, but uh, boys, uh, and I'll um, I'll see you on the next video. Ciao.